Hi Air Science, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising and those cross-watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at what is your person's, what are their true thoughts, their true feelings about you, what goes through their mind when they think of you, when they hear your name. This is going to be a general reading guys, there's also going to be a part 2, an extension available to this reading. And you can access the, the extension reading via the extension link below, which will be provided just where the video he is under the show more section. And for those of you interested in a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire as well. My email is, address is going to be found just in that section there as well. Otherwise, guys, let's go ahead, give the cards a shuffle. I want you to take a moment. I want you to think about your romantic person. Uh and try and hold a vision of them in your mind's eye you know pause the video if you have to and we're going to go ahead and see you know what what are the innermost, innermost thoughts about you here what are their intentions for you and for this connection bottom of the deck you have the seven of pentacles which is the overall energy that crowns this reading okay this is interesting you've got the lovers card which is uh, a very strong presence of a romantic energy so this person is definitely very attracted to you very drawn to you there's definitely you know um, some very intense feelings for you here high levels of attraction high levels of passion for one another they potentially could be in love with you. This is someone who might be in love with you. They might feel themselves falling in love with you or see themselves falling in love with you. This is someone who could be catching feelings. It could also be that this person is very infatuated with you. So if they're not just, you know, if they haven't yet been bitten by the love bug here, then this is someone who is heavily infatuated. This is someone who is very very attracted very drawn here someone who can't stop thinking about you and someone who can't get you off their mind you know and this person feels things very strongly they feel their feelings very strongly towards you you know infatuation can be a very strong overpowering overwhelming feeling and this is what this person feels you're the object of their infatuation you're the object of their desire here this is someone who look i feel like they could they feel like they could be head over heels in love with you or it just it just they're so infatuated with you that you're you know they're you're their point of attraction it could be okay it could be that this person is just because sometimes with the lover's card, it can be, because the the infatuation is so strong and so intense, it could be lust that wraps and disguises itself as love. And maybe this person is, you know, it's, it's an infatuation that they feel for you, but they sort of justify this feeling as love, perhaps. That could be also um, the reason here. So, you know, what is it that goes through and uh, goes through their mind when they think of you or all sorts of things this is someone who you know they feel like you're driving them crazy here they do they feel like they feel like they have such strong feelings for you that possibly could be love or it could very well in the future develop into something more serious deeper and longer lasting this is someone who feels like you have all the qualities that they want in a romantic partner they feel like that you're very attractive that Honestly, you're perfect to them. It also feels like they, even your flaws feel perfect to them. They think, you know, it's very cute here. Um, they always want to be with you, okay? And this is someone who always wants to be with you, near you. This is someone who I feel like they're quite selfless in many ways. And they, you know, I see them more and more making you, making you a priority here. 
They can't wait to see you next. This is someone who's very excited to see you next. I think they have some very exciting plans for you on your next date with one another. This is someone who I think is very, like they're putting a lot of thought and time and attention into your dates and into them seeing you here. Um, expect to take a back seat with this person. I just think this is someone who, who wants to do all the um, all the planning here. I do see them as being a little bit possessive though. Okay, so they may feel a little bit insecure and a little bit possessive. They could feel like they want, right now, they might feel like they want a reassurance of your feelings, okay? And that could have something to do with their insecurity. They feel like, they feel really good about themselves when they're with you, but, want, but they want you to know that you're just as infatuated or just as into them as they are into you and you're feeling what they're feeling so they want that even though I think you, you know you're you may even have um, said this to them or even showed this to them um, you've communicated this to them whether physically or emotionally intimately but I think they're still because they're a little bit insecure okay the bit of an insecure energy that I think this person is they're becoming possessive is how I see it. they're becoming possessive and I'm getting quite insecure I think this is someone who suspects that their feelings and their emotions are a little bit out of control or for example if you if you suspect that this person is a little bit inconsistent it has something to do with their feelings here because this is someone who you know they're sort they're sort of caught up in the throes of passion here okay sometimes they're you know, come on very heavily sometimes they have to take a step back because it's just so intensely right their thinking goes haywire whenever they're around you they just I think this is an individual who does pride him or herself on being quite rational quite logical but this you know this love chemical infatuation or love he has definitely taken a hold of their brain and is making them think silly thoughts or is making them tongue-tied and really nervous when they're around you and it just feels like it just feels like this is someone who's losing control and losing their cool. Almost everything reminds you of them, or reminds them of you the other way around. Well, maybe you could relate to that yourself. But it just feels like they're just they're reminded of you in little things. I'm seeing details with this person. I'm also seeing this person pays a lot of attention to detail. Their mind constantly, like they're crushing on you hard and their mind constantly wanders off to you. You, let me tell you, you've totally consumed this person's focus and their drive here. Also, something about your smile. You might have... There's something about your smile, the kind of smile that they can't forget. Or is it their smile? They have this weird, silly smile on their face whenever they think of you. Like they, they're constantly smiling or they catch themselves smiling whenever they think about you. Um, and oftentimes I feel like their friends or their family members are telling them that, you know, they're daydreaming about you again or, you know, is this person on your mind again? They are, their emotions are a bit like a roller coaster, which is if, which explains, as I've mentioned earlier, which explains, you know, the fact that if they are coming across as a little bit inconsistent, like their emotions are very sensitive, they're coming across as a very sensitive being. And if you feel like, you know they're really giddy one moment and a little bit down and pulled back the next it's because this is like a bit of a a roller coaster and what they're feeling for you and it's a bit you know emotions are heightened and emotions are running rampant here and sometimes they feel like they're on cloud nine with you other times they just are feeling insecure and possessive um This is someone who can't stop thinking about you, and especially in this day of, in this day and age of social media, right? Uh, it's just so easy to stalk your object of infatuation, your object of uh, desire. And this person is definitely, I see them like liking all your posts, or even like dropping some very eager comments every now and then, or even if you don't know it. But I think this person is sort of just going over your photos or scrolling through your Instagram like again and again and again here. This is someone who's very into you guys. I do see this person coming in with a message or an offer and it definitely feels like it's related to emotion. So it could be an emotional offer, a love message of some sort. It could be that this person is going to open up themselves 
to you okay uh, and become vulnerable with you but I think that I see them coming in with an offer here and in part two of the reading we're going to explore what exactly is this offer because they're excited either they're really excited about your next date here okay because they're making plans they're making arrangements or they're excited to share something with you there's some sort of news or some sort of offer we're going to explore that in part two of the reading here we're also going to explore more about this affection and infatuation they feel for you okay and what exactly will be the future of this connection i see them inviting you to some sort of social event and it's like they want to either they want to show you off to their family and friends because they're just so you know they're just so happy that you're you've looked their way um or it feels like it's them inviting you to this function is sort of it will be like cementing your connection solidifying your connection with this person so follow me to part two of this tarot reading which is made by the extension link uh, made available via the extension link below for those of you interested in a personalized tarot reading feel free to reach out and inquire thank you guys so much for your time your energy your support Please show your support if you haven't already by subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting or sharing. Bye for now.